Hello, my little Willy. In today's tutorial, we are going to learn how to knit this super cute mini Christmas stockings. They are really easy to do. You just need to know how to knit and how to purl. They were made using straight needles and just about five or six grams of worsted weight yarn, wool yarn and 4.5 millimeter knitting needles or US 7. You will also find the written instructions on my website sewwoolly.net for the larger ones and they are perfect Christmas decoration too. So remember you can find my patterns on my website sewwoolly.net and there is a link for you below this video on the description box. So grab your needles, a little bit of yarn and let's get started. So first of all, we need to cast on 18 stitches. First row, wrong side of the work, we are going to curl every stitch. When I get to the last one, I'm going to purl it through the back loop, so we can avoid a huge loop there. Second row, right side of the work, we're going to increase stitches. The repeat is knit one, KFB. So knit one as you normally do, don't drop it, and now knit the same stitch through the back loop. So we get two stitches from one and repeat, knit one, KFB, knit front and back, knit one, KFB, knit one front and back and repeat to the end of the row. Ending with the same, knit one, knit one, front and back. Third row, just pull every stitch. Fourth row, knit every stitch. Row 5, pull every stitch. Mm -hmm. 
Now, in row six, you are going to do some decreases. So we need eight stitches. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And now we're going to knit two stitches together five times. So knit two together once, knit two together twice, three times, four times, five times, and we have nine stitches, so left, so just knit them. Row seven, just purl every stitch. Row eight, we're going to knit six stitches. And now we're going to knit two stitches together five times. One, two, three, four, five. Six stitches remain, just knit them. And row nine, just pull every stitch. Now we need to knit six rows more in stocking stitch. No increases, no decreases, just plain knit one row the entire row and then purl the other row and repeat until you have completed six rows in total. So this is how it looks like. You see? Now place the red color to your left, take the white, leave a little tail and we're going to knit every stitch using this white color. Turn your work and now knit every stitch. And keep knitting every row until you complete five rows in garter stitch. So that's two rows. We need five. We need three more. I'll see you there. Okay, we have five rows in garter stitch and now facing the wrong side of the work we're going to bind off knit wise. So knit one, knit the next one and pass the first one over the last one and knit one, pass over and repeat to the end of the row. Knit one, pass over Knit one, pass over, knit one, pass over. Okay. 
net one that's over now pull the yarn and we need to leave well first pass the yarn through the loop and secure and now we're going to join facing the wrong side of the work but here we need to leave a tail long enough to form the loop to hang the little Christmas stocking on our Christmas tree and just a little more to sew up until here so let's say this long now thread your tapestry needle and join we have to leave the loop, I always forget that like this Once more to secure and now we can keep going to the left. Okay, perfect. We leave that there and now we have to leave enough yarn for the other part. I'm just placing the tapestry needle below the V's from each side. Make a little knot and now, now we can just weave in the ends going up to hide this tail. To be just more sure, I split the yarn. This is a three ply, so just two in one side and one in the other side, and I make a double knot.
And that's it. You have your mini stocking for your Christmas tree. So this is everything for today, my little Willy. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and happy knitting.